And welcome back. Um, in this episode, I'm actually going to be helping Sir Hawk build his walls on his uh, sky fort. Um, see, the track has actually been finished, mostly. Uh, travel time right now, minute 47. Uh, I can probably increase that with more power rail. But that is going to have to come at a later date. Bye bye, Fort. Future Lighthouse. So, this will be the first time I actually record house. Um, another person's fort. Actually, this is the only other fort I've been to other than Spawn. So this is... this is exciting! I did this part so that mobs can't go from on the mountain onto the track. Little safety feature. Still gotta add lighting and stuff on the path so nothing spawns, but again, that's stuff for later. I think somewhere up here... yep. Wanna finish this up. So I'll actually pause right here and meet you at the other end. And I'm back. So that only took up, I think, three stacks. So I'm back here away so I can actually get a good view of it coming in. And all of a sudden we're getting lag on the server. That's his tree farm over there. Nice little white house. His little train hut. Which, first time I came over here, it killed me. Because it stopped right here and there was a block here. I... Uh, oh wow. So that's why it killed me. Yeah, this wasn't here last time. Yeah, it, it, that's a bit scary. Up uh, just a bit, just a bit. So push you over here for storage. Actually, better idea. Put you over here. There we go. Okay, now to figure out where do you want to walk. One fifteen. Oh uh, yeah. Yeah, he's uh, got a skeleton spawner underground here, and yeah, he's running into the same problem I had at my fort, because at uh, uh, elevation five is bedrock. Where do you want the wall? Should probably is there a bed in here? Yes. I'm gonna work over here. I'm gonna need to set my spawn. I think that was enough. There we go. Started it. It's in the raised stone.
That's interesting. I never thought of that. Interesting. See, I do want to have a trough running along with lava. Lightning mobs won't spawn on. I'll just start one level at a time and see what happens. Knowing me, that's not going to last a whole lot with this perimeter. Probably takes two stacks per row. Okay, so we're I'll just start over here then. Um start with plus four. This bring back memories of working on my own wall. Not exactly sure how a lava trough around the wall, how effective that would be as a light source to get rid of mobs. Aesthetically, it would probably look pretty cool. Probably like the uh, movie National Treasure. the end where they find the treasure and light up this big trough of oil lights up the whole place might be able to do something like that but again that more relies on what else will need 
to be incorporated, such as columns, floors. Let's see, so it comes right here. I'm going to end up blocking up your stuff here. Yeah, I'm burning through this stuff like butter. At least this is a renewable resource. So I can always make more. Just get a cobblestone generator, tree farm to cook it. Wonder if there's a way to automate the cooking process. Auto auto fill with wood or charcoal. Auto load cobblestone. Um. You might want to rethink your little hut. You might want to make it a more of a lean-to. I'll skip it for now. Probably gonna need to make a tower a spiral staircase somewhere. What was that? Pretty sure it was a creeper, but I'm not sure. Yep, creeper. Nice sunroof. Trying, I'm looking here. Looks like best place for a tower would be this corner right here. I might want to make that sooner than later. Do, 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 do. That's the only disadvantage of a sky fort. You fall, you're dead. Let's see. Any better way? <laughs> thinking, thinking. Well, first of all, this yeah, take fall damage. 
be more like that. There. Nom 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 nom. Carrots. Okay, so. Wondered when that was going to break. Okay, now what do I have here? Two. That might be doable. If I go have two spaces here and then go from there. if that's going to mess up the design he's got or not. Three, one, two. There we go. And then something like grr. Okay, so there. Okay, one, two. There's the two there, then the two here. Got a corner, corner. Straight edge corner. one <laughs> almost jumped down there okay I so need to get a new mouse. Now I just need to figure out steps. And of course I'm going diagonally. Not exactly easy to work with. small but we'll see Hmm. <laughs> 
I'm going to use up all of my stone brick just on this. a big mite. Well, I'll finish up this stack. Fail. I have to refill my resources, which I've still got plenty at home. I missed one. skeleton spawner made. I think you need 22 to get them down to half a heart. Maybe. Oh. I think you need to drop 22 blocks or to, uh, to get them down to half or a heart. Of course, I never actually tested that theory on my original skeleton spawner. I was going to drop them and have them die and have a hopper collect the stuff. So, probably 23 blocks then. Ow! Yeah, okay. The bow out at the ready. Uh, 
I could prop. I don't know. Is there any way to use a? Yep. Don't know if there's any way to use a lava blade to damage them. I know with golems that works, but if you're wanting to, you, let's see, yeah, you want to collect the stuff, so lava would probably destroy the stuff. So, probably not a good idea. Uh, falling, uh, probably the safest in terms of item collection. The world is loading right. <laughs> it's like I'm coming to the end here. Um, in terms of this walkway, I think it's too big. I mean, I like the concept of having the arches above it and everything, but I, yeah, not even my outer wall is this big. So I'm thinking is Let's see, was it down there? Yeah, over here's the way to the spawn town tower thing. And that's actually pretty much in line with the lighthouse. So if I actually go from that floor there, I think that's at 85, which is also the lighthouse, continue through leave the train terminal at this elevation and you pretty much walk under it and have a nice fancy staircase there. And reduce the width of the walkway. Because right now it's like nine blocks wide. I'll leave that for my own stuff. And... Yep, I need more wood. That stuff over... there we go. And I probably should get more sticks. There we go. Mob central down there. Mm -hmm. Where? I'm thinking on the ground, but I could be mistaken by my cows. Yeah, do not want to stand on a ledge. Uh, hmm. Not enough. There we go. Do, 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 do. Almost need a minecart to get to the minecart terminal. Where 
I think the reason it feels so slow is because I don't have view bob turned on. He'll just walk the wall and jump into the pen. I was wondering about the light on top. Okay, got plenty of stuff. And we're back. And I think this concludes this episode, so stay tuned to see the next part. Thanks for watching. Bye.